One more thing. This isn't really a percussion thing, but um, I've had some people ask me why I've gone video and why I'm not really typing much. And honestly, my students tell me that I'm much more effective if you can see my body language, my vocal inflections, hear them. And I wanted to explain something about negative influences. I have been a musician since I was 13 years old and I have been a writer really longer than that and we always talk about our influences those artists who make us want to do what we do unfortunately this world has a lot of negative influences as well and I don't want to make this a therapy session but essentially as far back as I can remember I never did anything right it was all Jeffrey why don't you play sports like these kids do Jeffrey, why don't you do these things that your friends do? Later on, it was, Jeffrey, why don't you have any girlfriends? Well, I was a sweet, shy guy. I was every girl's best friend. Not the least bit homosexual, but you live in a small town. That's the assumption some people tend to make. So I have spent more than 45 years trying to figure out why all of this negativity surrounds me. And it was really because I was taught to be that way. I was taught to assume that nothing I do matters, that all of my accomplishments are meaningless because it's not like everybody else. And I just want to say if you're younger or even just a tiny bit younger and you're in that place, get out of it. It's a spiral. It's a downward spiral that has come close to killing me multiple times. I have serious anxiety disorder. It's why you normally see me on my couch. I'm not agoraphobic. but it takes a bit to get me to to go outside if I'm not being paid but I'm really starting to enjoy the things I love I love playing percussion I love just playing with my instruments <laughs> yeah my students laugh at that too I love just moving things around and putting setups together and then playing and writing and recording I've got pages and pages of manuscript that I haven't even touched yet uh, working on poems, working on short fiction, and I don't know where my future is going to go right now. I've had a really horrible week with people who seem to think that because they don't understand me, that I'm the one who doesn't understand them. Not sure where that comes from. It is a classic uh, symptom of narcissism on their part. For me, I've just always been the nice guy. But now I'm coming into my own, so to speak. And uh, I will be doing some really good sounding, uh, hopefully good looking stuff. And I am available in the Jackson, Mississippi area. If anybody wants a percussionist who does something uh, just a little bit different. I also play an electronic drum kit. So if you want some drums, I can do that as well. I'm not necessarily looking for a job, just uh, some fun so that's my thing on negative influences and all I can say is they'll kill you stress will kill you anxiety will kill you if you let it overwhelm you and overcome you and I hope somebody is watching this and getting something really positive out of it because that's my story and I guess I'm sticking to it